Time for sports. Gorbaya has signed former Western Steamer FC striker Benson Omala on a five-year deal. Omala, shown during the 2019-2020 season where he scored a total of nine goals, helping Western Steamer to a seventh-place finish in the Kenyan Premier League standings. Omala's goal-scoring form peaked with the former Kisumu Day Secondary School student best remembered for a hat-trick against Kericho FC in December 2019. For this outstanding performance, uh, he was uh, voted the best player of the month by the Sports Journalist Association of Kenya. S. Jack Omala is expected to fill the void left by Uganda striker Juma Balinya, who exited the club this week and will partner with another new arrival in Tito Kelo, acquired from Vipers FC Uganda. The acquisition of Omala brings to six the number of players the defending champions have signed ahead of the 2020-2021 campaign. Gurbaya has subsequently seen six players depart the club for greener pastures. Tokyo Marathon organizers are weighing the possibility of rescheduling next year's race to September should the coronavirus appear likely to remain an obstacle by the usual date in March. The organizers restricted this year's event to elite competitors in response to the coronavirus pandemic but have indicated they are against excluding general entry runners for a second year in a row. General entrants who are excluded from this year's race were given automatic entry to next year's event. The Tokyo Marathon is one of the six World Marathon majors. This year's races in Boston, Berlin, Chicago, and New York have all been cancelled, while the London Marathon will feature only elite runners after being postponed from April to October. The national rugby team is set to get financial boost from World Rugby as they prepare to take part in the Tokyo 2021 Olympics. World Rugby has announced details of Rugby 7's investment strategy to optimize the sports preparation for and participation at the Tokyo 2020 Olympic Games, now scheduled for July next year. In a significant boost to unions and players, the International Federation is making a dedicated initial investment of $2.5 million to support Olympic and qualified national teams prepare for seven the Olympic Games.